What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name's Anasha, AKA Drippy Nails, and I'm back with another nail video. And this time I'm asking the guys questions. So if you're interested, definitely stay tuned for this video. Okay, so guys, I did a questionnaire with some guys and I wanted to get their opinion on how they feel about women and their feet and their nails. I'm gonna read off all of these guys' opinions on how they feel about women and their feet and we're gonna discuss like some of these guys' opinions when it comes to nails because Guys don't usually be caring about what women have, but then they be caring about what women have. Isn't that kind of funny? But anyways, let's get let's get on to the comments and things about the opinions. Okay, so let's start with the first opinion. This guy says, if guys liked fake nails, they'd get their own. We don't care, and we're not particularly impressed, period. As long as your hands and feet are taken care of, that's all we really care about. And he said, sorry, we don't notice your latest overpriced haircuts or dye job either until you let us know. <laughs> so with that being said, I'm not sure. Hmm. I know a lot of guys that do typically like do notice that type of thing. This guy, he just he says for majority, he's speaking for the group. He's speaking for the group guys. He's saying majority of guys. So whoever's in his group, he feels like guys don't care. On to the next one. I personally prefer natural nails. The reason for this is twofold. I like back scratches. <laughs> Hilarious. You can really get a nice back scratch with some really nice stilettos just for anybody that didn't know. But anyways, he says, I like them for back scratching, therefore I don't need a woman with the ability to keep her hand in front of me while being able to scratch my back for me. And he also said, I love women that can open a soda can without breaking something. Okay, that is hilarious. I wish I had a can right now that I could open with my nails just to show for this reason. You know what? I'm actually going to do that. Give me two seconds. Okay, so I have a can of peaches, right? A can of peaches. This is what I'm going to do. See this? Nail, right? So what you don't want to do is you don't want to go under the can with your nail, right? Because of course it's going to bling, fake, bling, all flip off. So what you want to do is you want to shimmy your nail under, under, right here. Look at that. Pop. There you go, you have a drink baby and these nails are super long. But that's if people know what they're doing with their nails. I understand where you're coming from, but you still can do stuff with nails. Like you still can do stuff, you just have to find an alternative route. That's literally all it is, but thanks for, thanks for the comment. So the next guy said, I personally don't care either way, as long as she doesn't have witch nails. By that, I mean nails that are unnaturally long, nails that long kind of freak me out and I don't understand the reason behind them. I feel like they just make literally everything more difficult. <laughs> and honestly, I probably could tell real from fake anyway, but if your nails are longer than your fingers, yes, I've seen this, hi boo, hi, hi. <laughs> if I see your nails longer than your fingers, then they are a major turnoff and I will avoid you at all costs. That is so hilarious, but everybody's entitled to their own opinion. This guy is not for the long girls, not for the- clean. I don't cook, I don't clean, but let I, me tell you, I got I, this ring. Double me. But it's okay, that's his preference. Everybody's entitled to their opinion here on this platform, as long as you're respectful, simple. Okay, so next comment, let's go on to the next one. I can't even understand why they turn anyone on in the first place. And that's good. It would suck if anybody liked the same thing the same way. But women's feet do nothing for me. They neither arouse me nor disgust me. And unless I get kicked by one, then have no impact on me whatsoever. So this guy right here, he don't care what you got, honey. As long as you got some feet and some hands, that's all he seems to care about. This one was really, really funny, guys. So I titled this one Mr. Foot Fetish, okay? Because I was just like crying after I heard this like story. So no shade to the people that like feet, okay? Everybody likes something around here. So let's go on to the story. I'm gonna read it just like how he sends it to me, okay? So he says, I have a thing for feet. So yeah, had pretty feet. Definitely pay attention to nails and feet though. I had a girl one time ask me to rub her feet and I'm like, and I'm like all right, cool, you know? But Shardy's feet look like she worked at the Krusty Krab and I don't know. I was just like, what the f 
how you want me to rub them things and I'm gonna cut my hands. When I thought about this, you know what was the first thing that came to mind? I'm gonna, I'm gonna insert a clip. Like this is the first thing that literally came to mind. One thing I'm gonna say, I have to say this, I have to say this in this video because I'm just kind of to the point where I'm just like, I know everybody's entitled to an opinion, but I'm just like, okay, guys, for the guys, like, let's be real. Half of you guys' feet look horrible. If we're gonna be so honest, like, if we're being honest, like, the girls be at least trying to stay to par, okay? But y'all feet be looking like, okay like come on like let's 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 tone it down just a little bit let's not be super critical about women and their feet let's just because y'all be okay 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 you see what i'm saying like it just doesn't make sense to me personally but you know i'm just here i'm just the messenger telling you guys what the guys are thinking but i'm just sitting back thinking like Y'all are very, okay, shame. everybody's entitled to their own opinion and they're anonymous as well. So everybody is not supposed to be everybody's cup of tea. That's definitely the truest thing. Okay, so I also peeped a couple of things from all of the guys that I asked. And I'm gonna talk about a couple of the topics that they really seem to like touch on when I was asking them questions about feet, hands, feet, shoulders, nails, and toes. Okay, anyways, but I was asking them a couple of questions and one of the top like common things that were coming up were topics of color and then also about foot jewelry. So this was a surprise to me. So I'm gonna start with the polish. So guys were saying like they really don't be caring about what polish color, like don't ask them what color and then you don't get it because and they feel like you just wasted their time asking them something that you're not gonna get in the first place. <clears throat> We're all guilty, okay? Let's just be honest, we'd be guilty. It's just like, yeah, I wanted to see, maybe you would've thought of a color that I don't, but if we be honest, ladies, like most of these guys don't even know what burgundy is compared to red to magenta, like, let's be honest. So most of them were saying, we don't care. One thing that I had noticed also that a lot of guys were saying is, they really love the classic white toes like that is just like if you even have ugly feet like the white toes just do something like so the people that be thinking that they have ugly feet or whatever the guys are saying stick with the stick with the white toes but when it comes to asking them questions about the colors they feel some type of way okay so one of the other ones that was really surprising to me that a lot of the guys were talking about was women wearing heels and also jewelry so when it came to these things that they said that they really liked guys really liked when your toes are done and you have heels like they were saying this is one of like their biggest turns on turn-ons when it comes to women and their feet so guys don't typically pay attention to it but they said whenever a woman does have heels on or something or has her toes out best believe they are looking at your feet they're looking at your feet they're looking at your heels they're looking they're looking they look in and another one that was kind of surprising i had a couple of guys talk about this one and this came from the guys that didn't really care about um didn't really care about the feet being done and they happened to say that they really like the fact that some girls wear bracelets after they get like their feet done like one of the guys had said that ties into this he says women with feet done are sexy as hell because you want to massage caress and kiss their feet but he says one thing that he really hates though is if your feet aren't done if you got toenail fungus or anything like that he ain't gonna touch you but anyways but back to what i was saying like a lot of the guys that were saying like some of them that like them done some of them that don't like them done like they really really like the jewelry like the bracelets the anklets the toenail rings like i didn't even think that guys would even like pay attention to stuff like that because like you know what i'm saying like why would they even but of course they're gonna notice something different so um definitely jazz up your feet ladies like you can definitely find a whole bunch of like foot jewelry and stuff like on amazon and things like that if you want something really quick but that is definitely what a lot of the guys were mentioning um that they really like when women do have their feet done or if they're freshly manicured some heels or like nice like foot jewelry or something like that but definitely they're staying away from the crusty heels okay that like the cheese graters ladies the cheese graters because the results 
the results are saying they a lot of people got these crusty heels and stuff it's some cheese graters that i keep telling you guys about but so that's all for this youtube video guys thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in another one